Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Play the Hits. Nick, this is attempt number two of one of the all-time classics, Super Mario Brothers 3. How you feeling now? Nobody needs to know about the first attempt. It's already on Twitch. Everybody knows. By uh, everybody, 1988 I mean. was a good year. 1988 was a damn good year. I was one year old. Well, anyways, like I was saying, uh, Mario Brothers 3, it's... Um... Pretty close to one of my favorite games of all time. Uh, I don't know where it ranks for you. It's pretty damn fantastic. It is um, my second favorite 2D Mario and third favorite overall. Huh, okay. Yeah. God damn. For... Wow. Oh, also, I, I mean... haven't played it in 12 years, so get ready for that. <laughs> no, I was... Um... As, as a kid, I swear I probably played this, like, you know, 30 sometimes, as kids do with their NES games, because, I mean, let's be honest, you, you got, got one yeah, Mario right. every two years, if you were lucky. For reals? But, uh, yeah, there was just so much content packed into this game oh, that, know. you know, I ki kind of just wonder how they fit it all into, um, you know, one cartridge. This was back during Nintendo's era of you know, cramming secrets into absolutely every nook and well, cranny. No, 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 I mean, like, games. logistically, how they crammed so much into the cartridge. Oh, like, yeah, they I know. really pushed the memory to its limits. All right, I guess I'm playing as Green Mario. You're Green Marmo. But yeah, like, my point was half of that was just secret content. Like, the freaking warp whistles, like, the, the hidden things to discover in each level, like, you could not um, turn a corner in this game without unearthing something and then sharing it with your recess buddies. Oh right, yes. Uh, for the uh, the uh, school schoolyard chat about secrets that you know, fifty percent of which probably didn't exist in the first place. No, like I'm still to this day, I'm still trying to bring Eris back in FF7 with the fucking vacuum cleaner. But well, pff, I mean, heck, uh, when I was in school, I uh, I had a friend who swore up and down you could uh, find Jesus in Super Mario Brothers. Uh, what was it? Uh, uh, Super Mario World. <laughs> oh, God, that's hilarious. Oh. Hmm. I see hmm. that low latency is so, doing its job. A little bit of an input delay. Yeah. I'm usually pretty good at this game. I was but... going to say, though, actually, since I turned that on, did it help at all? Yeah, actually, I'm noticing quite a bit that okay. it's uh, a lot smoother. So. so so it's better than it was. Still not perfect, but yeah. Get over here, you bastard. Come here, you son of a bitch. I'm turning you into a coin. So, uh, full clear, you think? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I, th I say we get the warp whistles, but then we don't use them. Hey, we inadvertently unlocked the coin ship. We did do that. Man, I always used to wonder what the hell that sign was when I was a kid. Um, I assume it's Japanese for, like, good fortune or something. Yeah, because of all the coins. I think it's, like, actually the stamp on a yen or something. Okay. I could be wrong. I think in order to get the ship... Oh, it's got a weird precondition to it. You've got a... The oh. last digit of your coin. Hey, thank you. The applause I'll, I'll applause myself. Yeah. But yeah, I think the last digit of your I'm coin go, has here. to match the last digit of your score. Oh yeah, yeah. Is that right? And it, if you get every coin in this level, you unlock what is it? Uh, the White Toad House. Oh, too late. <laughs> <sighs> That's awesome. Man. Oh man, I remember the White Toad House. I think I got that by accident once too. Oh. All it gives you, I think, is P-Wings and Anchors. Oh, well, shit. Oh, you missed the one up back there. Oh, I, my God, you're right, I did. Dude. Like I said, it's been at least a decade since I've played this last. But... Uh, but this, this game is so ingrained into my mind. There we go. Remember that one, at least. At least through brute repetition. Yeah, I was going to say, there's, there's a good number of things. So you're... Um, I was that kid who did use the warp whistle, like, half the time. So somewhere in the middle levels, I'm going to become a lot less useful and a lot more forgetful. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, uh, you can tell who used the warp, warp whistles because, uh, World 7 Pipe World is, like, this anomaly they've never seen before. Right. Well, what is this? Why oh, are there, there so many Where do these go? Well, I got one right. star and one flower. I'm useless. Go, Luigi. So, wait, uh, do we pool lives, or how does that work? Uh, I don't think we pool. No, I think we each get our own. Okay, cool. Also, like, it, it's kind of crazy when you get used to, um... Yeah, there's a... Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Oh, almost. There's that, but there's also a... 
Fla uh, yeah, whatchamacallit, Tanuki. Uh, there yeah. you go. Or, or no, Tanuki like is the full suit, isn't it? This is just Raccoon. Yeah, yeah. This, yep. Because because Raccoon makes, you know, sense. Gotta yeah. hate when those raccoons fly up into the bird feeders in <laughs> my house. You imagine? Like, you're just taking your trash out one day and you fucking see a raccoon zooming at your face just doing this. <laughs> Oh god! Well, this has been an unmitigated disaster. Wow! For maybe it'll real? bounce back. I've oh, never well, seen that. Nope, the NES just ran out of memory. <laughs> there you go. Well done, sir. There he is. You, you know what? You know what? All I need to do is just get my running start. Oh and no! I'm fine. We missed a warp whistle. That's all right. Uh, yeah, there's a warp whistle. We but, weren't going to use I mean, them anyway. It's just going to take up inventory space. That's actually true. Maybe we should avoid those. I mean, we don't need to prove that we got them. I'll let you have the mushroom are. house there, since, yeah, I feel bad about the warp whistle. You gonna get the warp whistle, or you gonna fight Boom Boom? How you gonna play that? We're, we're gonna fight Boom Boom playing it. You know what, what the hell, why am I even pretending <laughs> I'm gonna get that? You know, um, one of the things that always, well, not. One of the things I became to appreciate later on playing this, like, say, when I was, like, 25, is just how the, the variety of the levels, um, you know, you notice that you need to press up. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, it's, it's a doorway. <laughs> I forget you. things. One of the things that always impressed me is that um, the stages are a lot better than just move right and press A. Yeah. Um, it, there's a lot of good variety. There's not a lot of levels that are just kind of like, uh, oh, one of these again. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it's really cool, too, because they're probably some of the shortest levels in, like, any mainline Mario game, but they're mm. they're all super memorable. Like, But there's also, yeah, you know what? You're right. They they are very, very memorable. They have a lot of I impact. Guess, guess nice. Nice. When I was a child, I used to have a vendetta to be able to get all the coins off this ship. <laughs> Uh-oh. Is he gonna do it? <laughs> he's thinking about doing it. Hey, guys, Knuckles here. I heard he's playing some... Uh, what the fuck is this shit? It's, what? Uh, it's it's proto-Sonic. <laughs> right. you got goddamn right. It's proto-Knuckles is what it is. Beta, beta Sonic Adventure. You guys couldn't get your hands on that Chaotix, Rama. <laughs> <laughs> You know, I wouldn't mind playing Chaotix. It doesn't look bad. I've never played Knuckles Chaotix. Hey, I did get all the coins. So Not you guys bad. is just going to bust balls then tonight. That's what this is. <laughs> but no, really, I've never played Knuckles Chaotix. I, I never had a 32X or a Sega Saturn. I mean, surely we can... Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh. Um, uh -oh. I think we're losing internet again. Interesting. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. I don't know what it looks like on your end. It, it looks like you're just jumping around the screen randomly. Hey, there's a blue mushroom. Well, that was disturbing because okay. I watched that mushroom get away. <laughs> That's what hilarious. You got it back, though. This is so strange. Like, um, have you been having internet connectivity issues today? <laughs> Well, I mean, when doesn't uh, Spectrum suck, right? Okay. Well, I was going to say, I, I wouldn't doubt if it's on my end tonight, because um, we are having some thunderstorms, but... As much as I love Switch Online, I'm assuming 20 bucks gets you 20 bucks worth of, you know, online stability. Uh-huh. There's a fire flower if you take the lower route. Yes, that's right. Well, you yeah, do I mean, it's game. 20 bucks with free games, but, you know, I, I guess when your internet goes out on you with for, you know, when you're in the middle of a game, I mean, <laughs> yeah. Though, whose fault is that? I don't know. I, I'm, I'm going to guess one of our internet providers, actually, though, because Max and I made it through the entirety of Crystallis, which is an RPG, and never really had these kind of issues, so I'm, I'm thinking it must just be a bad night. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> well, I will keep my fingers crossed, just like that uh, tree in the background. Yeah. Well, though, now that you mentioned, though, Discord doesn't seem to be giving us any problems, so... Huh, gee, it really is cold in hell today, isn't it? Yeah. That's weird. Dis Discord's doing fine. Switch, not so fine. All right, Whatever. we've got eight Luigis left. Eight Luigis. 
I guess maybe we'll need to stockpile lives just in case we run into latency issues in uh, World 6. Oh god, yeah. Oh, <laughs> don't you worry, my friend. I'm going to be save stating after every um, castle completion. <laughs> oh, okay. One, so Neat. that we can pick this game up again uh, next time on Play the Hits, but then also because, let's be real, something will fuck us. I think we can probably knock this out reasonably quick. I, I'm, I'm willing to bet this is two, maybe three episodes max if we're doing every level. Well, yeah, it's it's not a long game. No. Especially when you've got every pixel memorized. <laughs> like I said, at a certain point, it's going to be Chris is going to keep dying. <laughs> Nick is going to carry us through. Bail water from the ship. I got gotcha. you. That's right. <laughs> it's okay for Until worlds one and two. Takes me out. For worlds one and two, I'm your boy. Okay. <laughs> I'm your, Good to I'm see you. I'll carry us out of tutorial. Hi. And Nick is pulled away with lives. <laughs> and I'm in the double digits, so I should be fine. What That's other all. um, what other NES gems did you enjoy? So um, I was my first console was actually the SNES, ah, and okay. I loved it so much that one Christmas I asked my parents for an NES and come on there you go oh damn it and um they, they did oblige which was nice um all right but my experience was largely much more with the with the uh, SNES than it was the NES but that being oh, said that being said though I could certainly still appreciate so a lot of the games that I liked and played with my friends were of course Super Mario Brothers 3 but um I never picked up the original Legend of Zelda until, you know, decades after, when I was just, you know, hunting for it in used game shops. Um, Unpop oh, go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. This is an unpopular opinion. Um, <clears throat> I actually liked the adventure of Link, um, oh, yeah. or you Legend of that. Zelda 2, more than the original. Yeah. And, you know, I, I'm, in a, I'm in agreement there. Well, I, I really didn't get to play much of either of them. But um, oh, really? the original Legend of Zelda... Um, it, hasn't oh come on chris hasn't aged super gracefully so that's just my i don't thought. know I, I still feel like it's plenty playable but it's got it that kind of it's got that kind of taint where nowadays if i picked it up i'd be like you know 10 minutes in all right where, where's the guide i don't have time to figure this yeah, stuff out yeah and, and you know like why why am i playing this when i could easily be playing link to, god damn it be playing link to the past right now hey good I remember to catch it in the air or else it doesn't count you gotta be cool um, so let's see here. I love Mario 3, I love the original Mario, and I love Mario 2. Mario's just a good series. Um, I loved the Kirby, um, game for the NES. Um, oh, and then, yeah, but I've actually got a st story about that. Where we start getting more into, like, the obscure ones that I really loved. Um, I know you're not much of a sportsman, This but... guy is very foreign. <laughs> right? <laughs> Thank you very much for- oh, god, Mario, stop imitating him. Um... Did you ever play a hockey game called uh, Blades of Steel? I have never played any um, sports games at all. Okay, ever. so Blades of Steel was awesome. I liked the Duck Hunt and the Olympics game that you played with that running pad. Um, there was this one, like, I forget what it was. you get two? Yeah, I get two. <laughs> oh, so I forgot about that guy. Um, never mind. There was um, this, like, beach sports game. I, I forget what it was. It was like... It was like a collection of mini games, but you like surfed and skateboarded. It was it was surprisingly fun. Um, I liked for all of the the shit that it gets. I did actually like uh, all of the Ninja Turtles games that were released on the NES, even like the horrible uh, first one that I've never beaten. Um, mm -hmm. it, it's just nostalgic enough that like even though yeah, once I get to the water level, it's done. Like you can't beat that. Um, it's still just fun. Verified impossible. Oh. oh dear. Um, but yeah, those were all good. Um, what else? Oh, I all loved right. Contra. Um, Super C, I never really played. I, I, I like original Contra all the way. Mm -hmm. um, never played Ninja Gaiden until years after, but that's a pretty good one, too. But so, yeah, uh, so, so that, that's kind of most of the extent of my NES experience. So I came really close to owning an original copy of um, 
Kirby's Adventure for the NES. Oh, but, yeah? Uh, so my dad got it at Toys R Us back when we lived in Texas. And um, my mother had a fit because I was only allowed to buy educational games for <laughs> some sort of edict. That Moses' was Bible out. Adventure and... Uh... <laughs> well, so what happened is my dad ended up having to take um, Kirby's Adventure to this uh, back oh. to the store. And I got stuck... Um, my mother instead proceeded to buy me um, Sesame Street's uh, Counting Adventure. Oh, God. <sighs> Somehow I that's... sat there and I played it. Somehow that's <laughs> less educational than Kirby's Adventure. <laughs> that's... You know what? I don't think you're wrong. <laughs> I bet you would have learned a lot more playing Kirby. <laughs> there was like a counting game, a match the numbers game, a game where you had to get Ernie's rubber duck oh, back to him. Yeah. What, what hath God wrought? And then, like, some sort of spelling game involving a Ferris wheel, and um, that was it. That was huh. $60. Oh, I got your money's worth there, did you? <sighs> Not even remotely close. Give me that shroom. No! <laughs> No, not the molten cheddar cheese. I this is also another one of the levels where if you get all the coins, you unlock the uh, white toad house. Oh, really? Oh, there's no way you can do it in your Oh, I state. missed it already. You need to be large, and also this one is just really hard to do. God bless it. So, funny story about the input lag. The only place where it's really noticeable is trying to climb out of water or sand. Oh, that's going to make World 3 delightful. Uh-huh. Oh, for God's sake, Mario. Well, just try not being in the water. All right. Ah. Your turn. Well. <laughs> Never mind. Nick's going to pull away early here. All right, let's see here. Let's see if I can work some Ouija magic here. Ouija magic. Oh, well. I guess I'm going to blame that on the <laughs> internet. Well, I'm dead. Thank you, input lag. Uh, that was horrifying. Okay, yeah, the internet's really not our friend tonight. I'm watching the bar go from, like, blue down to nothing. Yep, same here. Huh. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking this has to be internet issues, but I'm not sure. There's no way to tell on whose end. I guess I could... The next time I die, I could do, like, a test and see what my um, current uh, rating is. Wow. Hey. Almost blew that. That was well handled. So, going back on the subject of uh, Sonic from earlier, I believe they're going to announce a new Sonic coming out soon uh, for Sonic's, fucking, what? It better fucking 30 be Sonic year anniversary. Mania too. <laughs> yeah, I know. Just at this point, just hand the reins over to uh, Christian Whitehead, right? Seriously, man. Like, they released a 3D Sonic game after Sonic Mania, and it did not take. It was no Sonic Mania. That's about all I can say. Uh-huh. Wait, did I... I missed a bunch of coins, didn't I? Yeah, but I wasn't going to harp on it. Yeah, whatever. We made it through the level. That's what counts. Now, did you hear about the uh, new Mario RPG coming out? No. Oh, wait. The new Paper Mario? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah, okay. Well, it's it's paper. It's Mario. It's an RPG. Technically, everybody's right. Yeah. Let me see here. I'm downloading the uh, internet speed test real quick. Speed test by Ookla. Okay, let's see what we've got here. Ooh, that is bad. I mean, m should be more than able to handle Super Mario World or Super Mario Brothers, but um, it, it is low on my end. Huh. I'm gonna not try to pull off fancy shenanigans given uh, the uncertainty. Well... But that's... Well, I don't know. Oh, okay. Wait, no, that's my 2G connection. That should be all right. But I'm playing the Switch on 5G, so let's switch to that and do a speed test. Mmm, quality content here tonight, Nick. All right. This is the first boom boom, isn't it? It is. Because I completely bypassed that other one. Whoop. Oh, he's pulling some shit. Way to compensate okay, for the lag. You just can't let him get away from you for a second. Okay, yeah, no, my, my, my 5G internet is absolutely flying, so that should not be a problem. So, uh, you like my switch icon there for Rex? I do, that's that's impressive. How'd you His, get the um, ears? I think they're eyebrows. 
Oh, okay, I see what you did there. That's clever. Um, oh, I hi. guess we're fighting? Well, fuck you too then, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I guess we're going. I guess we're going for it. Marmo versus Ouija. Oh! Ouija well, wins. Now nobody gets the star. <laughs> now, I really thought I was supposed to go to the castle. I'm sorry. Now nobody gets it. Well, I'm taking this then. <laughs> oh, right, I always hated see. these. Oh, okay. Um, those two are almost always supposed to be all right. An item. Oh, there you go. That's something. Uh oh. No pressure. I I used to have the algorithm for all the uh, cards. Memorized. Oh, really? Yeah. That's impressive. I don't know I why I entered into the battle royale. Right My apologies. Well, you were checking the internet while I was beating down Boom Boom, so... Beating down Boom Boom? It sounds funny. <laughs> boom Boom beat down, right? I was gonna say it sounds like Nick's struggling valiantly to um, relieve himself from constipation. Beating down Boom I, Boom. I was uh, more or less just kind of picturing uh, Mario beating uh, Boom Boom down with a crowbar, but hey, <laughs> That's tomato, it. tomato. Who does Boom Boom work for? Boy, there, there's a series that uh, thankfully never got uh, reanimated after it was uh, ceased being relevant, Austin Powers. Oh, yeah, that's right. Who, well, that, that line who, was who does number, number two one work, work for. for yeah, yeah, right. It's still, still a good line, though. That was a fun series, too. Yeah. Well, um, the first two were fun. Do, do you remember when the plot of the third movie um, for Goldmember became the actual plot to James Bond Inspector? That was actually kind of clever, yeah. <laughs> what? No, what? But at that... What? But at that point, they had recycled so many of, like, their I mean, jokes. no, I mean, just, just so that my stance on the issue is uh, unequivocal, no, Spectre was complete and utter bullshit. Well, yeah, but uh, that, we, that was the we, point. Mommy and Daddy liked you more. <laughs> so then I created this terrorist organization. Oh, shut the fuck up! Right? No, no, no. <laughs> I, mean, that I, was I, his motivation I know the James Bond Dad movie was him. terrible. I just thought it was great that Austin Powers lampooned it. Well, Austin Powers came out 15 years beforehand. Um, right. Oh right, wait, right. for real? What am I thinking of? What the hell? What are you thinking of? Yeah. What am um, I thinking of? Spec You're right. Spectre is straight up a new Bond movie, isn't it? Spectre came out like... Do you even oh listen when God. I talk? No, I listen, but I, for some reason, I was picturing a Roger Moore Bond. Um, You might be thinking of... Well, I don't know. No, because you're right. Spectre was its own... Animal. Well, that, okay, now, oh. that that came out at a weird time because um, whatever rights that... Um, oh, no! Oh, the, okay, so, total side note, this level absolutely horrified me as a child. Well, come on, Chris. The, the thought of the sun chasing me was just a strange existential weirdness. Okay, what You're am I doing to, wrong here? You need to build up uh, some speed and jump into the tornado. I thought that's what I'd been doing, but... But no, you need to jump into it, not run into it. Come on, Chris. You can do this. You're embarrassing, you're embarrassing yourself in front of the internet, Chris. Uh, I, you're, I don't understand. You're not, you're not jumping soon enough. Clearly. Okay. Ugh. Jump! There. there you go. Oof. See, now you just have to avoid the sun. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. Thank you, input lag. Oh. But anyways, whatever whatever weird um, bundle of rights that uh, the distribution company paid for um, when they got the rights to the Bond franchise, for whatever reason, they didn't get uh, the rights to Spectre uh -huh. as villains. So <laughs> that's why for 20 years, um, neither Pierce Brosden nor um, Daniel Craig were allowed to say the word Spectre. That was awesome what you just did. I oh, really? really thought I could kill him. I yeah, so that. that's why, like, they just pretended for 20 years it didn't exist. Oh, that's funny. So, and that's that's why, yeah, so. There you go. Not, again, not a huge fan of Spectre. Ooh. Thought I had him. I think you we'll, should have we'll had him, him twice. <laughs> I mean, he's really, he's really uh, glitching the, the shells. Can he's you just moving him? so fast, I, I can't tell where he's going to be next. I'm starting to think you can't kill him. 
There's no pattern to his movement. Oh, there you of course go. I can kill the sun. All these years, I never thought to murder the sun. There we go. Ooh, all stars so far. Well Neat. done. Except for that one I took from you. That should have been another five up, but uh. So, so, so on that note, what was your favorite Bond movie? Out of curiosity, because I watch, um, because I refuse to pay fifty dollars a month for cable, so I watch Pluto TV. Yeah, and they got I an old James Bond channel. So, what's your favorite James Bond movie? Oh man, hmm. My favorite Bond movie. I mean, mine is by default always going to be uh, Goldeneye. But... Oh really? Okay, I was gonna say the Man with the Golden Gun. That one's pretty good. That one's pretty good. Yeah, help yourself to the items. I probably... I, I think I, we I don't play, share them. I play... Oh, we don't? No. Oh, okay. As I say, I because I play so conservatively, I never use mine. That's... I thought the items were pooled. All right. Oh, maybe they are. You're not gonna... You're gonna oh, go my God. Route? Yeah, I was going to. Well, I think there's a leaf right in this block over here. That's okay. It's a lot easier to hit if you kick him at, into it. There, there we go. go. Somehow I saw that happening. I'm not making this easy on myself, am I? <laughs> Holy well, shit, it's been dude. Like, it's been a decade since you've played, right? Yeah, but I don't know. Like, I don't think it's the game just being slipperier than I remember. I think okay, I just now, suck. Okay, now, this is one of my qualms about Mario Maker, is that all Mario's control differently. Like, mm -hmm. you know, because like uh, one of the things that still gets me is when you jump on a Goomba and Mario won the original, you don't jump up, you actually lose momentum. So right, yeah, you don't you bounce You can't pull off, off like fun jumps. Mm -hmm. um, oh so, God, but dude. like in Mario Maker 2, you can, and like they all control differently. Uh-huh. So, yeah. But I am I am blowing this really, but like it definitely... Like, I'm, I'm kind of thinking about Super Mario World's controls, because that's probably the most recent 2D Mario Which I've played. Is, yeah, they're all substantially different. So if you played a different Mario than this beforehand, I mean, it's it's understandable. But at the same time, it's still no excuse, given how much of my time I sunk into this game as a kid. <laughs> well, again, that was, uh, that was a long time ago, right? That was then and this is now. What? People suck times, with age. Times were simpler back then. <laughs> It, it certainly does feel um, definitely more um, slippery than I remember. Yeah, a little little loosey goosey, but I think the control scheme on here was probably the best out of all the uh, yeah. Marlins. Like when you get used to it, like when you when you get it under your thumb, then it's yeah. it's pretty now, impressive. Now, but... Super Mario World, that I did not care for as really? a game overall. Um, well, I mean, overall, I certainly enjoyed it. Yes, but. Um, I, I just, I could never get used to the controls. They just felt very slippery. See, to me, it's the opposite. I feel like Mario World felt tighter to me than, than this one. I don't know why, but... <laughs> different folks for different strokes, I guess. Yeah. Wait a sec, that's not right. That's Strike that, reverse it. Side Stroking note, Mario's strokes. I yeah. found this out just a year ago. Did you know in Super Mario World, you can re-enter castles you've beaten after they've been destroyed by holding L and R and then pushing start? did not know that. Really? Blew my mind as a kid. No I would shit. sometimes restart an entire game just to replay <laughs> through castles. No shit. Uh, do I want to go to five or pyramid? Let's go to pyramid. Yeah, I hate the pyramid myself, so. Plus, we gotta take out the Hammer Brothers at some point. Yeah. Uh, this, this, was a, this was an interesting level. Those bastards should not be... Oh my god, dude. Oh my god, <laughs> dude. That's like, right, now I'll, I'm just I'll... psyching myself out. I'll just kill one of the Hammer Brothers. You're welcome. Okay, thank you. Dude, I suck, though. Like, legit. I really thought I was going to be able to just hit him, but... Okay, all right, you're up. <laughs> I'm up again. Let's With try this again, all three of Chris. your Marios. We're probably going to see a game over here in World 2. For me, anyway. I, right. what, what happens? Do they, like, pool our lives, or how does that work? I, I think I can take lives from you, but, um... I, I have some to spare, no worries. may not want to at this point, but... But, anywho, like I was saying, this was, um... Chris! Cool level idea. You know, why don't I, why don't I just handle this one? Oh my god, dude. This is, this is gonna be, like, unequivocally your playthrough. <laughs> well, I do love this game. Real well <laughs> I'm glad you do, because, uh... Not gonna be much I've been, use. um, 
I've been fighting the itch to play this for a Swear long God, time, did, actually. But... Oh, yeah. So, yeah, because I wanted to at least keep it fresh for when we played through it for yeah. our channel. For me, I think it's maybe a little too fresh, if you catch my trick. Bordering into, like, you sure you've played this before? Speaking of too fresh, um, the uh, swaggering gentleman that I am, um, this week I managed to finally make my own line of... Uh, cologne slash perfume out of essential oils nice what do you smell like these days um hmm. there we go i wanted to try not to destroy all the coins but um i made this really nice blend so that's a combination of patchouli lavender and orange hmm. nick doesn't smell like boom boom nice you didn't have to do that but you did well you know <coughs> every, everyone up helps Especially when I'm hemorrhaging them. We we don't know that yet. I mean, maybe everything will work out just fine in the end, but just in case. Maybe Chris is secretly good and he's just having a bad day. That's not what it is. Ooh, okay, all right. That's not what this is. And let's try that again. Oh. Nope. Let's hold on. Not okay. There you go. And there we go. There it is. There it is. But for real, dude, I'm, like, dying in ways I didn't know I could die. It's all right. Just kill that hammer, brother, and we'll be fine. Come here, hammer, bro. I'm coming to you. He's going to kill me, isn't he? These guys can be tricky. Oh, my God, dude. So, like, I swear to God, I'm, like, I'm, I'm inputting things that the game itself is not registering. I'm good. That's right. I'm blaming the controller. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he moved back instead of forward. Oh, oh my god. I always dude, thought, I it always looked to me like they were throwing socks when I was a child. Socks, yeah. <laughs> I yeah. can see that. Oh my god. There we go. Dead hammer, brother. Holy shit, though. I'm... Yeah, maybe you might want to stop by the card house. Uh, I'm not going to get him. Hey! Uh, my boy, Champ. You I know. Uh, did you know if um, oh. if you let Chomp Chomp snap at you 43 times, he'll break his chain? Oh, for real? Yeah. I'm not going to do that. <laughs> no, because it's surprisingly quick and aggressive, and he oh would probably murder you. Uh, considering I can't make it past goddamn Goombas at this point. So the reason I jumped there is I thought I was going to fall through mm -hmm. that line, and I'm giving you a play-by-play -play of how I blew it. Tight. So I've always wondered, is the three here for Super Mario 3, or is it the third act? Or, or, or the third screen, or I don't know. To me, it looks like the three from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 3. I'll just take my frog suit. Turtles in Time, which was not the excellent video game, Turtles in Time, which was actually Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 4. All right. Oh, oh shit. right out the gate. These guys suck. Oh. Yeah. But hey, warp whistle. Hey, I got my uh, got my Tetris block. Cool. Uh, let's see, a bonus unlocked. There you go. I'm not taking that from you. Holy shit, you're gonna need that. <laughs> I'm gonna need it with all 25 of my lives. <laughs> I'm I'm such dead weight at this point that the the best service I can be to you is to God damn. Oh no 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 no. Is to offer up any like resources as a sacrifice to help you get through the game come here you fucker there we go there's a vine there to your there you go uh excuse me there we go mario's climbing animation is a little weird it is i kind of preferred like the weird mario dance from the first game chris oh yeah you're right <laughs> Mario just on that note, um, for Mother's Day, I did end up watching Goodfellas with my mother, as that seems to be our yearly tradition. Oh, nice. I gotta really say, um, Goodfellas tends to be one of my favorite movies. Huh. Your P-Switch is the middle one. Eh, well, you don't necessarily need the P-Switch, though. I'll show you. 
show all of you. But uh, yeah, you know, um, I loved that is like um, vintage Joe Pesci in that movie, just ad libbing all of his lines. Right. Hey, nice. Cool. Hold on. Slight there's recovery. A, I think there's a one up in there. There, that's movies. all I wanted. Okay, good. You got your one up. Good, good, good. <laughs> that was all I wanted to get. God damn it. All that's up there is a leaf that you clearly don't need. Fuck it. And watch out for the chain chomp. There you what go. What chain Hey, chomp? nice. You got a star. Finally. Good God. Is that the first level I've beaten in like five levels? Uh, that's not important, Chris. It's a little important. <laughs> it's a little bit important. It's a little right, bit like emotionally here. important to me that I can still play this game. Look, look, look at look at uh, Green Mario there. Yeah, I know. Just pretending it's not Mario in like a <laughs> like Luigi's clothes. Luigi, I am Luigi. What what are you talking about? Ooh, okay. Okay, All I right. think it was. Oh wait, no, that was the one I was thinking. Of. Oh well, there you go. Oh shit. They can never be adjacent. I know that for sure. That one's not. Yeah, there you go. I, I don't I know like what, that if that's correct. Too far. But... All right. Well, I hey, knew that I, middle I one, wasn't it? <laughs> Hello, yeah. it's me, Luigi. <laughs> totally not Mario in green shirt. What hath God wrought? No, dude, I'm telling you, the input lag is real. Uh, I won't pretend I've ever been particularly good at uh, that mini game. Yeah, even so. Like, it doesn't oh, make it God, any easier when you press a button oh, and then, like, it's half a second later it goes in. Just picturing Luigi just going after the king with the news newspaper. <laughs> Luigi, right. Luigi, stop! Stop! You've killed our king! Tell my daughter I always believed in her. She will be a fine Oh queen. god, it's a talking spider! Hit it some more! <laughs> Turns out the princess is a spider too, and Luigi decimates the royal family. Uh, yes. You know, Super Mario Brothers and the Quest for the Spider Queen, my favorite game. Spider Queen. So I, I know that um, they weren't aiming for realism in any way, shape, or form. This is a Mario game. Oh, how, you how, how the that fuck the do second. these airships fly? Look at this. Um, They're connected by long screws. What how about I propose? Um, how about I propose this instead, Chris? How about the? Instead of worrying about the physics, how about the moral conundrum of the fact that Mario is just going by? systematically assassinating every member of Bowser's uh, family. I know, right? He's going like, for he's his going children. He's going through killing all of his kids. It's like Punisher. Right? He kills his children first, and then he comes into his house <laughs> and kills him. <clears throat> we don't know Mario, that the princess is even being held captive. Kids. She could be there voluntarily. Well, I'm sure this is all some big game to her. Right. You're a big she boy. just likes when men fight over her. She's one of those kind of people. It's a, it's a control thing. You know, it's like when you have an argument with your girlfriend and she runs off. You don't follow. It's a control thing. Right? I mean, how would you feel knowing that two Italians stomp, are, like, actually stomping your children's head in and you're powerless to stop it? <laughs> Mario just took the escalation way too far. <laughs> well, you want to <laughs> fucking go? It, this summer. Oh, hey, it's, um... Wilfred Brimley. Oh, really? I was seeing, um... Oh, what's that porn star's name? With the uh, Ron Jeremy. Yeah, Ron, Ron Jeremy. Jeremy. Ron Jeremy. It looks like Ron Jeremy, doesn't it? Well, one of them. One of them is a porn star. The other one in works for NPR. I can't remember which. Same difference. Oh boy, the cloud. Hmm. Okay. Luigi, World Twenty Three. You're right. They do give you double level levels if you beat the uh, castle. Yeah, you kill a kid. You um. You get a free life. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. You get a free level. Kill a child. As much as I, as much as I love exploring um, all the levels, I'm going to cheap, uh, cheapskate the. I'm going to take the cheap way out of this level because I hate water levels. I so. would, especially given how the water levels are controlling uh, with the lag. <laughs> oh well, you have no problem <laughs> jumping out of it, so whatever. You just have to time it. It the timing can be weird. <laughs> no, Chris, you don't suck that bad. Well, I mean. You have to get like so close to the water surface and then press A again. And depending on where you do it, your momentum is going to be different. Right. So, Whoa, uh, nice. Anyways, um, so what else uh, do we want to talk about on Did You Know Gaming today? Um, 
I got nothing else as far as trivia goes. I did want to ask you. Know, you... The uh, Famicom in Japan was redesigned to look like a VCR in America because they were afraid the system would yeah. flop when they. Hit the they th they thought it looked too much like a toy, right? I heard yeah. that. Yeah. But I was gonna say, um, besides, um, besides this, which will be a relatively short project, this um... will also be one of the levels where if you collect all the coins, you get uh, <clears throat> a. Uh, I should probably Chocolate. just drown myself and give this level to you. Well, no, because this one is also difficult, so... I mean, could I pull it off? Maybe. There's a star in that block. There it is. Too late. <laughs> well, this is the worst case scenario. It's gonna be fine. There's a bunch of fucking fish. What are they gonna do? I think this is... Mm, you know what? I'm not 100% sure this is the level. I oh, could be wrong. no! Well, we're fucked. Oh, God. That was, that was cheap, you cheap, cheap bastard. This is every bit as panic-inducing as actually drowning. Well, you think this is bad? Wait till you get to the big bath stage. Ooh, you should have had him. Excuse me? You should have had him. Well, show us how it's done, Nick. You got robbed. <laughs> you got robbed, my friend. I'm sure those cheeps who failed to kill me felt the same thing. As they watch their, uh... Whoop! <laughs> Good <laughs> <scenes. laughs> Ooh. It's horrifying, isn't it? There you go. Well, problem done. Problem <laughs> over. Problem finished. Finito. Finito Mussolini. Okay, there we go. Oh, there was another star in there. Oh, there's only a star if you get the other star. Okay. Yeah, so long as uh, the star is active. Gotcha. <laughs> well, that sure takes the edge right. off this level a little bit, doesn't it? If you, yeah, if you, if you do it well. Uh, oh, God, that sounds like the most prickish thing I could have said. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> well, you, yeah know you know, I mean. provided you don't suck ass. I mean, <laughs> I mean assuming you had to have a, haven't had a lobotomy, it's uh, <laughs> not difficult at all. Assuming you're not a 33-year-old man who can't play a children's game, sure. <laughs> oh, God. I'll have to find a game that I'm good at. Nothing but stars tonight, Chris. Nothing yeah, but dude, stars. Yeah, dude, you're kicking ass. All right. Meanwhile, I'm hanging on the razor's edge here. Well, there's the hammer, brother. You got a star, don't you? Do, 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 do. So this is one so, stupid uh, thing that I used to do when I was a kid. I would try to make his words match up with the with the uh, song. So it was, pick a box, its contents will help you on your way. So pick a fucking box, pick a motherfucking box. I was a very um, uh, ornery child. <laughs> well, I think we all had those kind of weird things as uh, children, you know, with these old games that we played hundreds and hundreds of times. I'm trying to think of what some of mine were. Sir, sure, probably wasn't profanity lacing Mario lyrics. No, typically not. I was a very innocent little child. Oh, God. Ugh, still got him. Please, Chris. Still got him. Hey. Oh, a hammer here. You're going to have to remind me where to use that. Did I lose um, again? No, no, I'm still here. Okay. All right, stage three. Oh no, 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 oh, no, no! Oh, oh, oh. That big fish, yeah, that used to freak me out too. Oh, he horrified me as a child. <clears throat> he is not okay. I, I would have these horrible vor-filled dreams of him just consuming me. <laughs> that is the only about, time like, the weird baby tooth work. that he's got in there too. It's it's, it's not right. Oh uh, yeah. Did you say hillbilly tooth? Baby tooth. Huh. But yours Whoa. is better. Keep that there just in case. Or whatever. So don't do that. Chris knows nothing about this game. As it turns out. At this point, Nick like realizes he's been lied to and Chris has never even touched a Mario game. <laughs> he's not a real gamer. Whatever <laughs> What's that Mario? Is. Okay. Sh sh should I go for it? <laughs> Is that the guy who likes to go fast? Okay. All yes, right. go for I'm, it. I'm going to kill him one more time. Whatever it is. We're going to go for the... There we go. Oh, God. God damn you. Hey, you did it. Look at that. Look Welcome at that. back you... to uh, Let's uh, Watch Jaws. <laughs> cool. All right. Watch, he kills you on the way back. Oh. <laughs> there we go. This thing is Nick's kryptonite. Holy shit. Oh. All right. Good. We're good. We're good. We're good. <laughs> the ground even formed an L for Luigi. 
the universe is just shaping itself to its uh, new proclaimed uh, yeah, right. hope, I guess. The next game is just called Super Luigi Brothers. You're having trouble. Would you like to play as uh, Super Luigi? Oh, man, I can never remember which door it is in this castle. Oh, I think I remember which one this is. God I think it. it's the third one from the... Not what I wanted. Oh, I was going for the Fire Flower. All right, well. <laughs> now you can fly through <laughs> all the enemies, at least until your head hits the ceiling. Or until... Oh, uh... This could be useful. Yeah, yeah. No, it's definitely not that one. Oh, wait a sec. No, 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 no. God damn you it. Can just, you can just fly up there. I can. You can pick any random door. You're secretly a genius, Chris. Chris, you did it. I was waiting for that dry bones to take your pee wing. <laughs> <laughs> right. Or this cheap. All right, which one is it? Um, I don't remember. You have to go right or left. No, no, no. It's um. keep going to your right or left. You'll know. It's a stone structure. You got to walk up. Oh. Oh, okay. Uh, not that. Not that. Too far, but there's a one up in there. Cool. So okay. further back here? Yeah. Uh, actually, go in that door. I think there's a couple one-ups in there. This one? To your right. To this your one. right. Yeah. That one. To your right, 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 right. You can't go in those. Oh, right. Okay. Correct. Smart. Smart. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Um, just, just pick a door and go through it. And head to your... Oh, there you go. Oh, cool. Never mind. <laughs> what do you know? It worked itself out. Now you got to fight Boom Boom. Boom Boom. Fuck you. Come get it, Boom Boom. <laughs> so correct me if I'm wrong, but um, are the cannons in this game actually called Big Bertha? I think so. Or was that in okay. Super Mario World? I I don't know. I, I know that's what they're called in Super Mario RPG. <laughs> Nick, it turns out if I can cheat, I'm actually pretty good at this game. Yeah, too bad you only had one of those. Yep. I probably should have left this for you, but... Do you, I, um, I can care less at this point. Do you remember um, the Super Mario Brothers movie where, um, in a kid's movie, where Mario had to uh, motorboat Big Bertha to get the uh, crystal away from her? <laughs> um, one, of two, this one, one of two things strikes me. Either you're misusing the term motorboat, or I missed a hell of an episode. Um, this was the Mario Brothers movie, and no, I, oh, I do have to know this Yes, particular... that's right, he did have to motorboat the... <laughs> you know, there's no... It's gonna sound racially insensitive, but you can't not describe her as a big black lady, because that's what she was. That was also her name, was Big Bertha, Big Bertha, correct. <laughs> they didn't call her Big Black Lady, but... Oh. Haha, <laughs> oh. <laughs> joke's on you! Yeah, you're not taking it back. Yeah, that was a strange, strange movie. Kids' movies were a little bold. I mean, do you remember um, All Dogs Go to Heaven, which I think for the first 30 minutes was about the dog's gambling addiction. Yeah, right. And then it, and then it turns out... And then Satan becomes loose. Right, or... I was going to say, and then it turns out some dogs go to hell at <laughs> the, <end, laughs> no. the very end of the movie, traumatizing me forever. <laughs> oh, God, I know that was horrifying as a kid. Where he literally gets dragged down to hell. You know, I, I really got to rewatch that. That, that was, was some uh, fucked up shit. I was trying for a ricochet shot here. Never mind that I, I had some not very good, like, Sunday school teachers who were, like, operating under the whole, like, you need to be afraid of hell and that's the only way you're going to be a good person kind of mentality. You can obey God out of love or you can obey him out of fear of hell. Yeah, <laughs> right. Tomato, tomato. <laughs> as long as the job gets done, apparently. But no, dude, I, I saw that scene and I was like, holy shit. I want to go to hell. There's uh, that, that, that bulldog chasing uh, the main dog around with the machine gun. I oh my god, know. yeah, dude, that was a that. fucked up movie. God, what was wrong with, well, what is wrong with America? Five Goes West was about the systematic repression of immigrants coming to uh, the New World, except with mice. F why did I do that? Five Goes to Hell was about Five going to Hell. I swear to god, if you use that whistle. I was trying not to, so the buttons are screwed up on my Switch controller so that I, the jump button is correct. Bad Carpenter blames their tools. Right. And so uh, right now, I'm every time I, I hit a button, I'm just desperately struggling not to use an item. All right. See, now we know where the warp pipes go. Typically, these pipes are only useful for if you use a continue, um, because uh. if you die and the castle collapses the um, little doors that unlock remain unlocked. 
Come here, you son of a bitch. Really? Oh, whoops. I <laughs> wasn't sarcastic. Sorry, that wasn't supposed to be a sarcastic clap. I, I really thought you had him, and then... Well, it's like when you accidentally um, reply to someone on Facebook with the laugh emoji. Like, it doesn't mean if you're... It doesn't matter if you're actually laughing. You still look like an asshole. Right. Yeah, especially when they're talking about, wow, I had a really bad day. I'm thinking about ending it all. <laughs> right. And then you just reply with the laugh That's face. reply back. Laugh emoji. Nick, we're within 10 minutes, just so you know. Neat. Maybe we can finish this world. Maybe not. I don't know. Right. Well, maybe you could, and someone who is competent at this game... Dude, I can't believe how bad I suck. Like, I kind of want to practice the game in between episodes just to... Oh, I thought I, maybe I can slide? Not suck as what? bad. What's the gimmick here? <laughs> well done. Yeah. I jumped for you. There we go. There you go. I love the ones with a lot of hills. It's just fun. Sliding is always fun. Always sad. I don't care who you are. Sliding's fun. You go on that slide, you're gonna have a good time. Ooh! 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 Hmm. Come on, Morty, get the fire flower. Ooh! I don't know, Rick. There we go. I love how, to this day, Morty is still the voice for Rex. Right. I thought there was, uh, there's that asshole. Look at him doing what he do. Mm -hmm. you. Now you're safe. Oh, well, I got him as good as he got me. Actually, I killed him, so... Yeah, I was gonna say, he's dead. You, you just don't <laughs> have bullets. Oh, man, he's back. <laughs> you killed my father, you son of a bitch! I'm his son, Ziggy Koopa. <laughs> Isn't that actually one of... No, it's Iggy Koopa, not Ziggy. Ziggy was Z Bob Marley's son, sorry. Well, you gotta remember, there's like 14 different names for the Koopa kids. There was like... Uh, Iggy and Larry and Roy, and then they turned them to classical music uh, names, like with Be with Ludwig and um, so on. It. So, hold on a second, I just gotta think. Okay, I oh, keep wanting no. to hit the A button to go into I levels. I think this is the. I think this is the level. But then again, I've said that about all the levels. So whatever. Yeah, whatever. this is the guy. Ooh, ooh. I'm trying to remember what other kids movies were just like awful freaked up beyond belief i mean i was probably supposed to use the... that koopa on that never uh, that's fine i mean it is what it is this is fine. i think with the one up what you're doing is fine oh yeah land before time was uh horrifying god. uh oh god where's mother dies mother gets uh, murdered yeah you know movies did not used to shy away from showing the graphic death of parents True. Um, Today it's usually like an off-camera sort of thing. Well, well I, job, I mean, it's they need the emotional shock, but um, they want to get it done uh, quick, uh, quickly, so that you know the kid's not you know sitting there crying too much. <laughs> Before the musical number with Timon and Pumbaa. <laughs> well done, my friends. But uh, yeah, freaking Land Before Time. I mean, Littlefoot, like you know, he's sitting there talking oh. to his mom and she's dying. It was horrible they yeah, dragged that out they really did too that she took a while to die oh gosh um you have 38 by, lives. <laughs> by the way did you know um the voice of ducky from land before time was uh oh, never mind don't tell me joe pesci <laughs> wouldn't that wouldn't that just know. be the best way to bring this whole thing full circle oh <clears throat> that's not what i wanted good not what you I didn't get it Ducky is Joe Pesci. Anyways. Whoop. What the hell is that old thing? Just one of those little quirks I discovered as a child. Oh, that was on purpose. I thought it was the internet. Yep. That was me trying to go against, uh, go onto the bridge that wasn't bridging. Hey, God, it's, uh, what a spike. horrible existence that thing has. This whole thing is vomiting up spike balls. And then throwing them. And it cannot feel good. No. That'd There's be like passing a kidney stone on steroids. Okay, all right. Ooh. I can just never get up. <laughs> Trapped. Mario, please. Help, Luigi. Okay, there we go. Uh-huh. Uh yes. Yes. Of course. You know, Nick, given how utterly skillful I am at this game, 
I think it would be kind of hilarious if we were to play a new Super Mario Brothers game two player, like where we're both on the screen at the same time. Maybe able to swing that. Probably not like right after this, but some Mario Maker madness. I was oh say, yeah, it's burned out on Mario after 20 episodes. Something tells me I'm gonna need to drink after this is done. And away we go. We're four minutes away from the hour mark. I mean, we can go a little over, can't we? Yeah. I mean, we'll, we'll at least round out World Three. Yeah. What's the point of that? Guys. Nothing that I can see. I'm sure it was important. Oh, oh, wait, I remember. Okay, all right. Well, now Nick has to kill himself. No, 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 it's over here. It's over here. Oh. Turns out I don't even need the stupid thing. Oh, there you go. Oh, yeah, oh. okay. God, you legit have this game down pat, don't you? Hey, when I was saying that I had everything memorized, I was not kidding. It was this or Elmo's typing adventure. Okay, I knew there was an uh. Okay, Point. good, a cloud, because we know how much I love to skip levels. I'll take it. Oh, God. So either you get to go to the castle or you get to fight Big Bass. Take your pick. Let's go Big God damn it, Chris. Let's go Big Bass. I, I like the petrified looks uh, on those uh, hills there. <laughs> oh, he just ate, he just freaking ate you. I, I just got ate. <laughs> Man, I just you got You finally got gotten. Well, I guess I'll take out the castle. Oh my god, guys, you're not going to believe this. He got Mario. He got Mario? He was just going for a swim, man. All of a sudden, I don't know what the fuck happened, man. I was just getting a beer, and I looked out in the water, <laughs> and he wasn't there anymore, man. Shit. Oh, you can't use your tail underwater. Luigi. Now, is this a fire form? Luigi, just calm down, man. Tell us what happened. I just fucking told you, man. I didn't fucking say it. He's just there anymore. He's dead. He's fucking dead, and I <laughs> killed him. Luigi, calm down. <laughs> what am I going to tell Ma, huh? <laughs> She's in the home. She looks forward to Mario's visits every Tuesday. Son of a... You stupid glue strip ghost thing. Oh, look, you don't understand. She always preferred Mario. You guys gotta dress me up like Mario. <laughs> How there's, will we ever like manage tall, Green Mario? There's like tall, skinny Luigi, but he's in Mario's like really baggy clothes. Hey, my, it's me, Mario. Mario, why does your voice sound different? No reason, Ma. He's like crying. Why are you is crying? the only is the only canonical appearance of Mario's mother from the Super Mario Brothers Super Show with Captain Lou Albino? Yeah, I think so. I think yeah, I think so. I just picture her as kind of like an old Italian lady, though. Well, they did a lot of things that on that show that strangely became canon, non-canon. There you go. Just, just speed, just rush it. He, he no! can't kill. He can't eat what he can't catch. Though all credit to him, he should have had you. Yep. You've almost got it. Uh, oh. Oh. Ooh. I don't care about I anything else. I just went out. I just went out, Nick. Good job. <laughs> well done, Mario. The uh, box <laughs> is uh, over here. All right, Chris. Right here. There you go. Hey, good. Good and neat. After this level, there's Luigi. Mario, you're alive. What happened? Mario just got this like far off look in his face. I uh, I don't want to talk about it, Luigi. Oh, don't forget to use your hammer after when it's your turn. My hammer. Yes. Uh, I'll show you. Okay. Uh, like I, I think said. I passed up a... Oh, God. I think God. I passed up a... Uh... Oh, yeah, God. Oh, no, not as well as I... Oh! Man, fun Goombas, right? This is these little Paragoom... Come on! Come on! There we go. You, you weren't hating it hard enough, Nick. Now you... Oh, I thought I could... Uh... Now you now die. Now you die, you son of a bitch. Okay, everybody, now you die. This is for Mario. You're a crazy bastard, Tuco. That's why Jesse and I are going to kill you. <laughs> Eat these ones for Mario. Okay, let's see here. I need to... That doesn't blow up brick walls now that I remember. No, it doesn't. 
I don't think it does, no. Why would they give them to you right there, then? Uh, it's it's okay. There's a leaf in here. Um, oh, work yourself out. There we go. Oop. Nope. Nick, oh, Nick and his joystick. At least I didn't accidentally applaud myself. That'd be a little bit, you know, <laughs> gauche. All right, down we go. With my block. Take it away. All right, if I go to the right, I think I can get a Hammer Brothers suit, but I need the uh, frog power up in order to do that, so I won't. I was going to say, you actually had one of those in your inventory, I believe. Yeah, but I forgot to equip it. <laughs> but damned if I'm going to break into that treasure trove. I'm going to save it for when I really need it. <laughs> There's this one level where you really need it passes by. <laughs> 41 lives. Okay, use this to get to the raft. Uh, yes. Um, I mean, it's a canoe, isn't it? Whatever the hell it is. I love how it's still canon that in the first Final Fantasy game, the four, like, noble warriors of light get in their canoe and go to the volcano. <laughs> Can you, like, picture these guys in, like, 80-pound armor, like, just chugging it in a canoe? <laughs> Look at all these frogs suit you got, by the way. Its contents gonna help you on your way, so go now, ahead and pick that fucking box. I don't know what um, version of the game this is, but I think in the original NES version, if you use the whistle while you're on the boat, uh, you'd horrifically glitch the game out. Oh, really? Yeah, oh. Um, like, you would go, I think, to the warp world, but you would be somewhere that, where you couldn't move to any of the warp pipes. Oh, really? There's more up there. Yeah, but I'm giving them to you. Well, I'm not going to waste time going all the way around there. You take them. Oh, we're friends. You get the fucking I'm on mushroom my mouse. screen already. You get the mushroom mouse. You, uh... Fox, it's you, you take them, you know? Help you on your you way, so them. go ahead and pick the fucking box. You probably need this shit, so pick that motherfucking box. All right, just for completion's sake. Get the treasure. Dial M for Mario. So, um, I saw what may be my new favorite superhero movie last night. Really? Yes. Um, you know how I feel about superhero movies. Uh, The Atomic Superman versus the Army of the Dead. Never no, seen no, this one. it was Neutron, the Atomic Superman versus the Army of the Dead. Huh. That sounds exciting and erotic. It was a 1963 um, superhero movie uh, made in Mexico, where uh, oh, Mexico. the hero is basically just a uh, Superman, but he's a luchador wrestler instead. That's awesome. And all the fight scenes are basically <laughs> Mexican wrestling matches. It was great. <laughs> it was wonderful. Why like, am I not aware I, of this? I sat down and I watched it unironically and loved it. And you were just like swarm like every oh i can't land here yeah paradox uh, strangely enough you can't just land he just kind of looks at the castle from a distance like wanderingly there's no dock no dock in this castle go ahead and pick a box take this stupid yeah but anyway so that was my experience yesterday nice you know, grab so, the sounds like um, a good use of time gra grab the card thing there you go. Giving me all the bonuses, okay. Well, you know. Line up pictures, it's get alive. some lives and line up pictures now. Get and uh, I guess it's your job to kill Wendy. Oh, I'll kill Wendy. So is this Mario Brothers or is just this just the uh, D make of Reservoir Dogs? Oh, I blew it. I was yeah, like, it's a I was I was on fire with those. Damn it. So now who's Wendy and why does she need to die? Well, she's the one who turned the uh, king into... Why is he humping the throne? Oh, come on! He was just eating it, but, you know. No, he's having sex with it. Look at him. I gotta say, there are a lot of kings ruling over the Mushroom Kingdom. Yeah, I know. It's or like, these, it's like a feudal people. state. You know, they're constantly at war. It's like uh, Game of Thrones, right? Peach's reign is in no way secure. <laughs> Pe Peach is the over monarch because of how brutal she is. You look right. at her the wrong way. You challenge her. She sends the Mario Brothers after you. She's the Mario Brothers are just two Italian guys that she pays. <laughs> Usually in sex, <laughs> but not always. I'm seeing a really gritty Mario movie reboot, and I like what I'm hearing. 
Someone get me Paramount. Did I say Paramount? I meant HBO. Get me Steven Spielberg, or his non-union equivalent, Steven Spielbergo. Nick, I think I'm doing this wrong. Yeah, you can just not do that. You don't have to master that until I think the ship for World 7, and you can just jump over that. Yeah, or just walk under it. God, Nick, there's fire. You got fire. And Montgomery Mole. Okay, now wait. Don't jump into the pipe immediately. I think there's a power-up outside. Yeah, j jump around there. Jump around. Jump around. Jump. Okay, jump, maybe not. Jump. 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 I like how they got the little safety rail there. That's nice. Yeah, right? For all the, the Koopa kids. Oh, God, Wendy. God, Wendy okay, looks you're, fucking angry. You're doing, good. you're doing good. She looks like every cheerleader from high school. Which is, I guess, what she was supposed to be. Oh. There we go. Do you Boy. remember an episode of Mario Brothers when Wendy convinced her father, King Koopa, to kidnap Willy Vanilli to sing at her birthday party? <laughs> <laughs> I do remember that one, actually. Oh, gosh. Wouldn't it be great like Mario has the scepter, he lands down into the throne room, everything's supposed to be just fine. But the king's still having sex with the throne. Who's that? Who's this? My son. This is Middle Eastern Mario. <laughs> My son. I had never dreamed that we'd be reunited like this. Thank you, Mario. You will stay and you will reign at my side. Sorry, Dad. I gotta go get some of that Mushroom Kingdom Strange. Oh. Oh no, oh, my son. favorite world. This is a good one. Oh, but this is gonna have to wait until next time on Play the Hits. I am deeply Yeah, sorry. this is a good stopping point. So hey, three worlds down. Granted, they are the easy ones. And uh, <laughs> five to go. The easy ones. I'm just, that's funny. we're slowly taking off, uh, putting X's over all of Koopa's kids' faces. That's uh, that's three corpses on the pile. Mario just scratches their eyes out when he's done with them. <laughs> he's got a, he's got ta He's got tattoos on his arm. He, he, like, burns a cigarette, like, over their faces onto his flesh. <laughs> oh, this is the only way Mario can feel. <laughs> oh, this is dark. Oh, and we will see you next time.